Yesterday evening, in the parking lot of Trincity Mall, the popular social media figure Kevin Yankboss, Solomon was gunned down and, <laughs> and Solomon was reportedly driving his Chevrolet Cruze in the parking lot of the mall when he was confronted by a lone assailant armed with a firearm who opened fire on his vehicle. Solomon took multiple blows until the car lost control and smashed into a parking barrier and another parked vehicle, knocking him out. He was found unconscious in the wreckage. A district medical officer, DMO, arrived on the scene and pronounced him dead after he passed away from his gunshot wounds while he was still sitting in the driver's seat of the vehicle. After the attack, several others who were in the parking lot went for closer looks at the vehicle after realizing it had been shot up. They pulled out their cameras to make video recordings of Solomon as he lay in the vehicle shortly after the attack. After learning that there was a dead corpse inside the vehicle, there was a visceral reaction from several people. When the police finally came, they cordoned off the area and began their investigation. The motive for Solomon had not been established as of late yesterday by the homicide detectives investigating the case. As soon as the news of Solomon's his followers on social media immediately reacted, and many of them expressed their sorrow over his departure and their condolences to his family. However, quite a few users on social media also sought to speculate on the motive for Solomon's death, as they believed that someone who Solomon had targeted in his popular risque and abrasive humorous posts may have been responsible for his These users suggested that Solomon's assailant may have been attempting to get back at Solomon for the jokes that he made about them. On various social media networks, Solomon had more than 130,000 people following him. Later on this week, the Forensic Science Center in St. James will conduct an autopsy on his body in order to determine the cause of death. The <laughs> brought the total number of homicides for the year to 277. Thanks for watching.